TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 10 a.m. Eastern time on Wednesday, 30 minutes into the trading day. And it's Fed Day. We get a decision from the Federal Reserve, 2 p.m. Eastern time today. The market expecting no rate cut today, expecting one in the coming meeting, though. We'll jump over to that in a moment. Starting things off, we have the S&Ps right now flat, 29.26. NASDAQ right now, Negative by one point, trading at 79.53. We've got the Dow up 78 points, trading at 26,541. NASDAQ 100, negative by 11 points, 76.62. Gold contract pulling back a bit off three dollars at thirteen forty seven. We got oil negative fifty cents, fifty three forty one. We're going to get oil inventory numbers a half hour from right now. We'll be on the air for those and uh, checking in on Bitcoin because it's been making waves. Flat day for Bitcoin today, though. Ninety one thirty two notes and bonds ahead of that expected no rate cut. But the real consensus is will the Fed take out the word patience from its statement should be interesting. Ten year negative ten ticks. One twenty seven. 706 30 year negative 19 at 15413 we'll start things off and we're going to start things off with the 10 year today as we check it out ahead of the Federal Reserve statement and decision today. 10 years sitting at 2.09. Pretty remarkable. We were just sitting at 2.01 early yesterday before President Trump's tweet that he will be meeting with President Xi at the G20. What else we have in line? How about the Fed funds futures? There's your probability of a cut today. 19%. Fast forward a month, July 31st. July 31st, 82%. And if you really want to get into it, the odds that we're going to get two rate cuts, which would be pretty remarkable, two rate cuts, you jump up to almost uh, 50% in a few meetings. Pretty remarkable. Let's jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. Almost session highs as we speak, 26,544. NASDAQ 100 pulling up, pulling back a bit from 76.80 down to 76.43, currently sitting 76.56. S&P's 2925. Jump through these. There's crude oil 5384. A little bit of a pullback right at 9 a.m. Gold contract 1347 and euro US dollar 11204. Stay tuned, folks. Come back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Of course, we'll have those oil inventory numbers, EIA at 1030. Kevin Hinks and the team at TD Ameritrade, Fast Market at 11. Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. Have a great Wednesday. It's a 